A vintage Phoenix icon closed its doors last year. Cronkite News reporter Justin McDuffie takes a look at how Mary Coyle's ice cream plans to make a comeback in a whole new way. Mary Coyle's ice cream parlor has a chance to once again allow its customers to take a walk down memory lane. The nostalgic shop opened its doors in 1951. After being in business for six decades, Mary Coyle's closed last year, leaving customers yearning for that soda shop feel. Kind of seemed super sudden, and I noticed a lot of people on Facebook felt the same way. The growth of the valley has been tremendous since the store opened, causing many local Phoenix icons to get creative or meet their fate. Mary Coyle is attempting to make a comeback with the help of their loyal customers. They're hoping to raise enough money to create a food truck like these that travel across the valley. And Mary Coyle's is a place where um, uh, you can go at any time with grandma or grandpa and enjoy a uh, scoop of ice cream. With help from their fans, Mary Coyle hopes to raise $45,000 to make the food truck happen through their Kickstarter campaign. Any contribution, we're going to give you a certificate back for some ice cream. So everybody's rewarded for participating in this campaign. And Kristen Peterson was a frequent customer who contributed to the campaign in hopes to bring back the legendary ice cream shop. Now I have the chance to, you know, take my son there and even if it's just a food truck, I know that he'll get to have like the same experience that I got to have. Owner Mike Stofi hopes to have the food truck on Valley Roads by Memorial Day, just in time for summer. In Phoenix, Justin McDuffie, Cronkite News.